When the lights finally come up and the band takes the stage, it all looks so easy. But as their new album title attests, it's hard. Even though The Who has been world famous for almost two decades, they've been to this country several times. Absolutely no comparison can be made between their current tour and any other tour they've ever done. This tour is the longest, more than 30 cities, and technically speaking, the most ambitious. More than 1,300,000 pounds of equipment move thousands of miles in 19 tractor trailer trucks. 50 roadies setting up and knocking down enough electrical equipment to power a small city over and over again. 50 miles of cable unraveled and laid out. 200 speakers set up and checked. And finally, 14,000 pounds of lights raised to the ceiling. Townsend and Entwistle's guitars, Daltrey's microphones, speakers, amplifiers, all run by 5 million watts of power. The cost of a tour of this size is enormous, and normally that cost is carried by the fans. This time, however, the Who have a corporate sponsor, Schlitz Beer, helping with the promotion, allowing the band to go to more cities at lower cost. Finally, the arena is ready. After more than 60 hours of effort, the result. <laughs> 